Welcome, classic Hollywood enthusiasts. As we tread the illustrious path of cinematic history, the spotlight today falls on the talented actress Evelyn Ankers. In the vast tapestry of her filmography, a common question arises. Which work of Evelyn Ankers do you hold closest to your heart? Or, pondering the broader strokes of her career, one might ask, out of the many legendary works Evelyn Ankers has done, which one do you believe defined her career? Before we dive into the intriguing realm of personal connections, let's set the stage with some random facts about this luminary of the silver screen. Evelyn Ankers, born in 1918, left an indelible mark during the golden age of Hollywood, gracing the screen with her presence in over 50 films. She seamlessly navigated genres, from horror to romance, and captivated audiences with her compelling performances. Now, as we invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this classic Hollywood actor, we eagerly await your stories and reflections in the comments below. What role of Evelyn Anchors resonates with you the most, and what cinematic masterpiece do you believe defined her illustrious career? Embark on this journey down memory lane with us, celebrating the enduring legacy of Evelyn Anchors. Your narratives and recollections are the threads that weave a richer understanding of her impact on cinema. Share your thoughts and let's reminisce about this iconic figure together. Evelyn Anchors, the accomplished actress, shared the screen with Lon Chaney Jr. in five notable films during the 1940s. Their collaborations included iconic titles such as The Wolfman, the Ghost of Frankenstein, Son of Dracula, Weird Woman, and The Frozen Ghost. Notably, Anchors passed away 12 days after celebrating her 67th birthday. Following her death, she found her final resting place at the Maui Veterans Cemetery in Macau, Hawaii. Her contributions to the golden age of Hollywood, particularly her memorable roles alongside Lon Chaney Jr., solidified her legacy in the realm of classic horror cinema. The enduring impact of her work and the cinematic collaborations with Cheney continue to be celebrated by fans and film enthusiasts. Evelyn Ankers, recognized for her roles in classic horror cinema, faced unique challenges during the production of The Great Impersonation. In a memorable incident, director John Rollins initiated a love scene without providing any blocking to the actors, catching Ankers off guard. When she and co-star Ralph Bellamy hesitated, Anchors, known for her straightforwardness, quipped to the director, I would like to meet my leading man, as I have never kissed a man before first being introduced to him. Anchors, whose first name was pronounced Evil Lynn, brought authenticity and humor to her performances. Beyond her on-screen successes, it's noteworthy that despite collaborating frequently with Lon Chaney Jr., the two reportedly harbored a strong disliking for each other. Anchors was known to be unsettled by Cheney's attempts to scare her, leading her to describe him as a brute with bad breath. These anecdotes shed light on the challenges and dynamics behind the scenes, offering a glimpse into the less glamorous aspects of Anchors' career. Despite the rush jobs and personal differences, Anchors' professionalism and memorable contributions to Hollywood's golden age, especially in her iconic collaborations with Cheney, continue to be celebrated by fans and film enthusiasts. After the series Hawaii Five-O concluded, Evelyn Anchors settled in Maui alongside her husband Richard Denning. Their post-Hollywood life on the picturesque island marked a quieter chapter in the actress' journey. Away from the glitz of the silver screen, Anchors embraced a more serene existence, relishing the beauty of Maui. Known for her mastery in portraying suspense and horror, Anchors earned the title Queen of the Screamers for her blood-curdling vocal outbursts in B-thrillers of the 1940s. This epithet encapsulates her significant contributions to the suspense genre, solidifying her place as a distinctive presence in Hollywood's heyday. In a surprising twist, Anchors, after her retirement, made a return to the screen for the drama film No Greater Love, marking her final cinematic appearance. Notably, she came out of retirement to collaborate with her husband, Richard Denning, in this poignant film, showcasing a commitment to her craft even in the later stages of her career. Evelyn Anchors, with her post-Hollywood life in Maui, her iconic scream queen status, and her unexpected return for No Greater Love, leaves an enduring legacy that extends beyond the spotlight. Her contributions to cinema, both on and off-screen, continue to resonate with fans and enthusiasts, showcasing the multifaceted journey of an actress who left an indelible mark on the industry. 
Evelyn Ankers, a versatile actress with a lasting impact on Hollywood, holds the unique distinction of being the sole actress to grace films featuring the iconic monsters of Wolfman, Dracula, and Frankenstein. In The Wolfman, she portrayed Gwen Canliffe, shared the screen with Lon Chaney Jr., who portrayed the terrifying creature. This collaboration extended to Son of Dracula, where Anchors took on the role of Claire Caldwell and the ghost of Frankenstein, in which she played Elsa Frankenstein. Each time, she faced the monstrous presence of Lon Chaney Jr., marking a notable chapter in her career. Beyond her on-screen endeavors, Anchors contributed to the world of B-movies, showcasing her literary side by writing the introduction for the 1978 book The Golden Age of B-movies by Doug McClelland, published by Charter House. This venture into the literary realm emphasized her multifaceted talents and her enduring connection to the golden age of cinema. Anchors' personal life, marked by a twist of fate, saw her engagement to actor Glenn Ford, which ended when she encountered Richard Denning while Ford was away on location. This unexpected turn led to a lasting partnership with Denning, marking a significant shift in Anchors' personal narrative. In exploring the life of Evelyn Anchors, from her cinematic collaborations with iconic monsters to her literary contributions and personal choices, we uncover a story that goes beyond the screen. Her journey, filled with unique roles and unexpected turns, remains an intriguing tale in the annals of Hollywood history. Fame's Dark Side, the struggles of Evelyn Anchors in the wake of Hollywood stardom. Evelyn Anchors, born in 1918, made a significant mark on Hollywood as an actress. Despite her successful career, the shadows of fame brought their own set of challenges. Anchors, who passed away at the age of 67 in 1985, faced the darker aspects of stardom that often go unnoticed. Beyond the glamorous facade of Hollywood, anchors encountered struggles that echoed the common narrative of many stars. The pressure to conform to societal expectations and maintain a certain image took a toll on her, as it does for many in the limelight. The image count of 246, a testament to her on-screen presence, couldn't shield her from the personal battles that fame waged. The journey of Evelyn Anchors is a stark reminder that behind the scenes, celebrities grapple with the weight of expectations and the emotional toll of constant scrutiny. Despite the average year of 1943, when her career seemed to reach its peak, Anchors faced the challenges that fame brings, struggles that often remain hidden from the public eye. In exploring Anchors' life beyond the label of a Hollywood actress, we delve into the untold story of a woman who defied expectations but couldn't escape the shadows that fame cast. The emotional void left after achieving fame is a universal experience, and Anchor's story sheds light on the human side of stardom, where success doesn't always translate to fulfillment. This glimpse into the struggles of Evelyn Anchors offers a perspective often overshadowed by the glitz and glamour of Hollywood. Her story serves as a poignant reminder that, despite the accolades and adoration, celebrities like Anchors grapple with the darker side of fame, leaving an indelible mark on the narrative of Hollywood stardom. As we bid adieu to this cinematic journey through the illustrious career of actress Evelyn Anchors, take a moment to traverse the corridors of your own memories. Her performances, a kaleidoscope of emotions and narratives, have undoubtedly woven themselves into the fabric of your personal cinematic tapestry. Now, the stage is yours. Reflect on the indelible mark she left on your viewing experience. Was it the haunting allure of her presence in classic horror films, or perhaps the subtlety with which she brought characters to life? The echo of her performances transcends the screen, reaching into the recesses of your own narrative. In this shared space of admiration, we invite you to unravel the layers of your connection with Evelyn Anchors. Share your fondest memories, the scenes that linger in your mind, and the emotions that she effortlessly stirred within you. Your narrative, an integral part of this collective ode to a remarkable actress, adds depth to the timeless legacy she crafted. As we celebrate the enchantment of Evelyn Anchors' artistry, your reflections become a testament to the enduring power of storytelling. Let your words dance alongside hers, a harmonious duet across the realms of memory and imagination. Thank you for taking this moment to delve into the realms of nostalgia and appreciation with us. Your thoughts, a valued contribution to the ongoing dialogue surrounding the impact of actress Evelyn Anchors on the world of entertainment. Until our paths cross again, may the echoes of her performances continue to resonate in your cinematic heart.